Hi everyone, how are you today? So we are talking about skincare today. Uh, basically my favorite, my skincare favorite. You probably noticed that in my spring favorites video that I posted, uh, I think at the end of May, I didn't include any skincare products just because I wanted to dedicate um, an entire video to all my skincare favorites because I have a lot and I love skincare. So uh, let's get started because I don't want this intro to be. Okay guys, so the first brand that I want to mention today is Belief. Uh, you know that I love Belief if you watch my morning skincare routine or my evening skincare routine. Uh, I mention Belief all the time. Uh, Belief is a Korean skincare brand. Um, I discovered this, I would say maybe like five months ago. So I bought some of their products, I use them every day, I love them, so I wanted to talk about it. So the first one is the Belief The True Cream Aqua Bomb. This has a very lightweight texture and it basically looks like, I will show you right now, it looks like um, pale blue type of gel. Um, I have a combination type of skin and this is just like, it leaves no oily greasy feel after using it. In fact, I would say that my skin literally just drinks this up because when you apply this on your face, it feels like water. Exactly. Like I use water. it every day in the morning and I don't feel like I need something else, you know, it gives me enough moisture. So yeah, this is a really good one, especially if you have oily combination type really of skin. Moisturizing and firming eye cream. Again, um, a product that I use every morning. Unlike the previous one, uh, it is more like a cream but the consistency is not thick at all. It's very comfortable. And of course, very moisturizing. Um, and this little pot will last you for a very, very long time. I'm using these Belief products for like four months right now and I still have a lot left. Um, this one is quite expensive, um, but because you get a lot of product and it's very good, you know, I don't mind spending so much money on it, I guess. <laughs> and the last product that I want to mention and the last product that I have from Belief is the UV Protector Daily Sunscreen Gel uh, with SPF 50 PA++. Uh, basically, this is the best sunscreen I've ever tried. In so it looks like this white um, jelly type of emulsion, but again, has a super lightweight, watery feel to it. So it absorbs so, so it absorbs like a dream, no greasy residue, no white marks. And also I really like how the Belief uh, products smell. They have that um, natural herbaly type of scent, which I love, so it's a good one. This actually smells so good. Oh, oh, oh. This is a product that I wanted to try for years. But two years ago, you could only find this in France. Um, now you can find it also in UK. Um, I have just a little bit left. Um, you can find this right now in Boots. I mean, this is where I got it. Um, and I think some other stores carry La Roche-Posay in the UK. It is basically like a toner for acne prone skin. The ingredients list is extremely simple. So it has water sodium chloride and zinc sulfate. And zinc sulfate is really, really good for blemishes. I use this every day as the last uh, step in my skincare routine, or I can use this before or after my makeup application. Instead of a toner, instead of a, um, how to say, a setting spray, something like this, because it's good for your skin. So I prefer using this one instead of I don't know, MAC Fix Plus or something like that. I like to use this uh, also when my skin gets a little bit oily on my tiso because it does mattify the skin. Um, and I notice that I don't get as many blemishes. I don't get um, like those little bumps here and there after using this product. So yeah, I really like this. It's not a product that you will see the result uh, like straight away. You need to, you know, continuously use it, but I love this. I love it. Yes, yes. I also wanted to mention a whitening kit that I've been using. This is from Smile Sciences. 
and this is with the bubble gum flavor I chose this flavor um, they sent me this package um, I think two weeks ago and I already tried this once this is actually the first whitening kit I've tried in my life and I really wanted to test this because it's very easy, it's very convenient it's just like, you know, at home whitening treatment so why not and I want to see if is good or not. The kit includes a shade guide, a 5ml syringe of the FDA registered and dentist approved gel, two vitamin E sticks, an LED light and a whitening pen that you know for maintaining the results. So you get six treatments uh, in the syringe and 14 uh, with the maintaining pen, so 20 in total. And you can use this product up to 10 days until you achieve your you know desired result. Now this kit should lighten uh, your teeth up to 10 shades. Um, in my case it was 5 shades, uh, but that's I think an amazing result because um, I was not having like very yellow teeth to begin with. So I guess if you have more yellow teeth you will see the results better. I mean you will see those maybe 10 shades. I like that you get a lot of product in this syringe. One thing I want to say, do not overfill your mouth trays. You don't want that gel to get on your gums or like in your mouth. They actually say this on the box, uh, like do use and don't. Do not, do not overfill your trays. I was actually very surprised that this worked. Um, especially because I've never tried something like this before and I was quite skeptical, but uh, I'm glad it did. I will use this again, I think, in two or three weeks, so I'll have uh, like four or five weeks uh, in between each. Now, this is quite expensive, it's $2.99, and uh, I asked them if they can provide me like a discount code or something like that. Uh, so if you want to try it, you can do that. And they gave me the discount code EZNEON8. So you can buy this with only $29 instead of paying $2.99. So that's a really good price. And lastly, I wanted to mention that this is FDA registered. It is cruelty free and also it's made in the USA. The next one is the Mario Badescu Drying Gloss. This is a product that I use for years. This is an acne spot treatment, uh, contains salicylic acid, um, calamine and other like ingredients. So you don't apply this all over your face, you don't apply this uh, around your blemishes but just on top because it will dry out your skin and you don't need it. You take a q-tip, place that in this uh, pinkish residue here and then apply it on top. Usually I can see the results in 3-4 days, so it takes a little while but it's totally worth it. Uh, my boyfriend also uses this stuff, he loves it. So yeah, this is a fantastic spot treatment. Uh, so as I said, don't apply this all over your face, just on top and just a Next, I wanted to mention Sarah Chapman. Uh, this is the Skin Assist Ultimate Cleanse. Um, I picked this up I think two weeks ago in Space and K. Um, I basically wanted to buy a cleanser, like a cleansing ball, and yeah, I wanted to try something new, so I bought this. This reminds me a lot of the uh, Emma Hardy Moringa cleansing balm, but the only difference is that it's not as greasy, as oily as the Emma Hardy one, and also I like the packaging better because it comes with a pump. Uh, plus, you don't get that very overwhelming um, scent. Um, the Emma Hardy one smells, you know, smells nice, smells very natural, um, but it's a very strong scent. So um, I like this one. It contains a bunch of natural ingredients, fancy oils, all that good stuff. So you just massage this, and it transforms into this oily. Kind of consistency. I use this every day in the evening. It's brilliant at removing makeup and also uh, will not dehydrate your skin and will leave it very very soft. So this is really good. I also wanted to mention a few grown alchemist products because you know I love grown alchemist and I use some of the products every day or every So the first one is the Hydro Restore uh, cleansing cream. I use this religiously every morning. Um, to cleanse my face um, and I like to use this especially in mornings because it's very gentle, it's very delicate so um, it contains also a bunch of moisturizing ingredients and because you know I don't have makeup on, I don't have anything like hardcore on my face I just need a gentle cleanse so for mornings this is just perfect and yeah I love Grown Alchemist as a brand because they use a lot of natural ingredients however I will say that if you are 
if you have sensitive skin, if you are prone to different uh, types of allergies and stuff like this uh, because of natural ingredients, because of natural oils, um, you should be quite careful when using these products. So it's better to test them before you use them on your face. I love Grown Alchemist, they work great for me, for my skin, so um, I will continue to use them. Um, and this is why I mentioned these products in my video. Next I have the Enzyme Exfoliant. Uh, this is with Papain and Amida Complex. Papain and Amida Complex, they basically act as a natural enzymatic exfoliator. Um, so this is like a chemical peel, let's say like this. Um, if you watch a lot of my videos uh, when I talk about skincare, I mentioned that I use only chemical exfoliants and this is the one that I love at the moment. It is definitely more um, of a gentle one, so if you are new to this chemical exfoliation game, you can definitely use this one as so well. So basically this fruit extracts will gently like dissolve all the dead cells, so uh, you will have a very bright, luminous skin after using this product. So I use this um, every week to exfoliate my face. Uh, I leave it on for 5-10 minutes and then I take it off and, yeah. and the third product that I wanted to mention is the Age Repair Gel Mask. Again, it's a product that I use every week because it's a gel mask, it's very hydrating, very moisturizing and I don't need a lot of moisture every day. I like the texture of this one because it's like a whitish gel, so again it feels very lightweight, very cooling on the face. Uh, so it's just a joy to um, apply this on your face and to leave it on for a couple of minutes for 10 minutes. This is minutes. not an everyday product for me, of course. This is something that I use when I want to give my skin a little like oomph, to plump it a little bit, to give more hydration, you know, stuff like this. It's a really good gel mask. Next, I have the Saint Tropica Hot Oil Hair Mask. Uh, now, I mentioned this before on my channel. I still love it, I still use it uh, every other week. What I love the most about it is that uh, it contains just a few ingredients and they're very like natural and organic, so you don't get like a lot of chemicals here and a lot of nasty stuff. And also it smells divine. It smells like coconut, of course. Yes. It's called the hot oil hair mask because you need to heat it. Um, so it becomes that oily uh, type of consistency. You apply this on your hair, uh, you leave it on. Now, because it's warm, it will penetrate better in your hair follicles. So, yeah, this is a really good one. It's very simple, natural, so I really like it. So, you guys, that's it. This is my skincare favorites video. I hope you enjoyed watching this. So, let me know which are your skincare favorites. Because, as always, I'm very curious. And I want to try some new products all the time. I want to buy some new skincare products all the time. So, that's it. Uh, bye. Take care. Bye.